It is, what day is it, the 13th today? Yes, it has been raining all night and no leaking, yes. So hopefully that means whatever problem they found up there and fixed it did actually work. So thank goodness. Um, I have the morning portion off, um, but then I have a staff meeting at noon for the vet um, where they said we'd appreciate everyone comes in. Thank you. I know I'm still in pajamas. Um, so I'll do that and then it'll probably go right until like two and then I have to go to teaching. Um, so I'm going to get all my prepping done today as well as wrapping presents, my last batch of presents to wrap. Um, yeah, so I'll do that as well today. I came downstairs and the tree smells so good. I am so happy. I love it. Can't really see it because it's so dark in that room, but oh, so pretty. So just making myself on espresso. Actually, I don't even know what it's called. I did milk beforehand, but just and then cold milk and then and then added the espresso on top instead of using the foaming thing. But yeah. So, mm. so just going to start getting ready for the day. I'm doing just a clay mask, but now I feel like Santa. <laughs> it's a super acne and oil absorbing one and I don't really get acne here. And this is already, <laughs> I can't stop laughing, um, is already kind of dry sometimes because um, I have combination skin, but he, my bottom half is like <laughs> here is all acne prone and really oily <laughs> so, anyways or just like a guy shaving but I feel like Santa <laughs> there we go much better I've spent almost my whole morning just prepping for our last day um on with some students it's more just fun and games on this one I have a lot of things that um, we're already preparing for our next performance, which is our competition in the springtime. Um, so we're already organizing things. Um, and my Thursday kids have a lot more going on. My other days, a lot of the students are it's their first year or they've already like chosen most of the things. So it's not as much, but today I have lots of new things to show them so they can, they can think about things over the holidays. Um, but I do have to, uh, wrap presents before I go to my vet meeting. Um, so I'm gonna, I'll show you all the things that I've got for the students. Um, and then obviously I showed you for my kind of main coworker, um, uh, fellow teacher, the um honey so yeah i'm gonna wrap that as well <clears throat> and i already showed you the little ornament that i got for my student teacher um but yes that was done previously i already gave it to her but yeah everything else let's wrap presents so these are the presents that i am giving out for all the different age groups so the youngest students um grade ones twos and threes um get little plush toys and so I was kind of like what's your favorite animal and they're like dog I'm like mm, what's your second favorite animal and then someone said buddy so I'm like okay yes I know which one I'm giving you um and then so that's grade yeah grade threes and unders and then grade four five six seven girls they get notebooks and some are lined um yeah, some uh, and they're all different things. So these ones were from Costco. Um, these ones are from Michael's in the $1.50 bin, um, as well as a fun pen. So they get to choose, or not they get to choose, but that I've already assigned um, based on personalities. Plus, some students are really, they love to write. So I made sure they got lined ones, whereas other ones I know they'd love to draw. So they got an unlined one, um, plus just different things. I know one girl loves um, teal colors so I made sure to give her that and yeah um, and then I'll just randomly choose that and then my grade four five six boys which most of them I've already seen <laughs> but yeah they just get little things I could have given them notebooks but I don't know um, other years we've done these and it was a huge hit so yeah these ones we got from sweet delights um, and it's like a candy store and they made them so Nice. And then for my senior students, 
um, grade eight plus, just the cherries, chocolate oranges. So just a little edible. But yeah, so I'm just going to, yeah, that's so cute, wrap all of these up. Wow, that took like over half an hour. <laughs> I had no clue that it would take that long. My goodness. All right, so now I feel like Santa. <laughs> I'm back from my meeting and there's just enough time to take the dogs quickly for a walk. Um, we got to have lunch. Um, we had a variety of wraps and then there were two types of vegetarian wraps because half of the staff was vegetarian. It's a pet clinic. Um, and then the manager also brought um, donuts as well as Tim Horton's hot chocolate. So yes, I'm very well fed. And then one of our clients, which I shouldn't put that on there dropped off, which they put us on. <laughs> Chloe saw was so cute. Um, honey for, well, it was all of the stuff from their previous home clinic, which was ours. Um, and then they brought chocolate for everyone else at the new hospital to share, but no, that was sweet of them. So yes, honey. All right, who wants to go for a walk? Tripsy does handstands, so she looks like she's a bigger dog when she pees. <laughs> I guess to the, all the other ones smelling her after. <laughs> I am brewing the David C. Avon Calendar Tea of the Day. It is a green tea. However, it is ginger turmeric tonic and it smells very gingery, which is awesome. <laughs> I do like ginger. so. I'm hoping that it tastes as good as it smells because we all know I don't like green tea, but that ginger actually smells really good. So we'll let it steep and we'll try it while I get ready to go to work. So let's try this. Wow, that is really gingery. Of course, the fact that I steeped it for 15 minutes probably didn't help, but definitely hides the, gin or, um, the green tea smell and flavor. All right, so off to work. I decided I don't want to wear the same like red or burgundy shirt, so I went with green. The only thing is this one is slightly low cut, uh, especially if I'm like bending over. So we're wearing a drama scarf. I think actually my mom gave this to me when she went to New Orleans, but it's perfect. I love it. I should wear it more often, but. I, it took me like five minutes to try to arrange how this will be and then I still don't know, but I just can't do that, so like this. All right, and so then because I already have like a dramatic scarf, I was like, I better not have dramatic ears or earrings. I don't have a lot of fashion sense, but I do love my earrings. Um, so we just have snowflakes, yay. All right, off to work now. I'm back from teaching. This was our last day of 2018. Boop, boop. <laughs> I got some presents. Pereira Rocher chocolates, as well as a little baby diffuser, um, as well there's a bracelet with some lavender or essential oils in it. And then, which I didn't show last time, um, and I already have it in the dishwasher to do it, but, oh, I got a Shakespeare mug. It's the love mug. Look at it. Fancy. And it has different quotes. It's so cool. Oh, I love it. So I'm just washing it right now. Um, yeah, one of my little kids unwrapped the the present with like the book and the pen, mm -hmm. and the first thing she said, "I don't like it," and I'm like, <laughs> "Like it's a gift." I was so then I'm like, "Oh, well, I can keep it if you want," and then she's like, "No, no, I want it." I'm like, "Okay," uh, and then. Like, oh my gosh, like, come on, this is, it's a gift. I don't have to give them a gift. And actually already before they're like, what's our present? What's our present? I'm like, how do you know you get a present? And they're like, well, you gave us one last year. I'm like, maybe you don't get one this year. And then that was the same one that was like, I don't like it. Hmm. But everyone else seemed to at least, well, either appreciate it or like it, or at least just didn't say that they didn't like it. So, but she's little, she's only grade two, so. Forgiven, <laughs> but still. Um, yeah, so uh, now just working at the vet tomorrow and the next day. I'm getting my hair cut next Tuesday. <laughs> All right, Dan is already hard at work making some food. Trimmed up the herbs from the arrow garden so they're not 
as pig. Whoa, look at all those herbs. Good job, honey. Thanks. <laughs> all right, let's get changed. Now we get to eat dinner. Mm, smells really good. We're gonna watch some TV. We've been loving The Marvelous Miss Maisel. Um, we've already watched the first season now. It's the newly released season two. Yeah, so tomorrow I have a 10 hour shift at the vet. So not that exciting, but hopefully we will. Do you wanna decorate the tree tomorrow, do you think? In the evening? Perhaps, we'll see. All right, <laughs> so thanks for watching today and see you guys tomorrow.